John, it's official trailer two for Monkey Man. Dev Patel's back, and we are back as well to react. Bye bye. This is the full trailer. I think the first one was a lot shorter than two minutes fifty two. I didn't even um, remember we did the first one, Stephen. Yeah, yeah, then you remember, told me yeah. seventeen thousand people had watched yeah. it. It's, <laughs> it's, 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 uh, it say, John, it's obviously universal, isn't it? Universal Pictures. Um, so it's it's, yes. it's kind of a western. I do remember Indian it. type film. It's a so. Superhero thing, isn't it? It's almost like Batman. Yeah, where he's overlooking. Yeah. City, am I right? I don't know. I think so. <laughs> we'll find out, I won't hope we? So. Yeah. This is going to be a rehash for me. Yeah. Uh, no, I think you're right. I think yeah. there's obviously it's, it's it's a it's a figure that's a lot of our community commented on. You know, so yeah. it's not something that's just been you know sprung out of thin air or anything like this. He's obviously a, a well known character. So yes, looking forward to seeing it. Dave Patel, you know what you're getting. Fantastic actor. So and he's directing as well. Wow, is he? Is he? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, the di directing debut. Yeah, yeah. So he's directing and acting. Your memory's not that uh, bad. I remember. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Oh, I don't doubt myself. Uh, shall we press play and get into this before yeah. this mouse starts walking? I'm getting the sense it's coming. Yeah. And I can't be else widening it up. Uh, press play. No. I don't. I even know my mother's name. Do you know any of their names? I take that as a yes. When I was a boy, they took everything from me. The rich don't see us as people. To them, we're animals. Both of us. We're broken. If a man wishes to challenge the gods, he must become more than a man. He must become the moon, sort of a granite here, though, with all these experiences and fight. Yeah. I remember that. Who is he? Nobody. Just some crazy kid from Nagata. He has oh, to be extinguished. Is that fucking... Before you're nobody <laughs> becomes a sucker. Just one small ember can burn down everything. Make them remember your name. Which is fantastic. But a week away then, we're talking. Yeah. So, oh, I can't wait. Looks John, absolutely you incredible. talked about it um, uh, in terms of like Batman. Uh, in terms of the the symbol, it's more yeah. of a symbol. Yeah, and and you saw you that in Batman, Batman Begins, I think that was the sort of emphasis they put on. You know, he didn't want to just become a like a, a man in the shadows. He wanted to become a symbol as hope for hope for the yeah. city. Um, and that's the kind of vibes I'm getting there. Certainly John Wick vibes as well, but... Dev Patel looks... It's a man possessed. Looks he looks as though he's got real growth. Yeah, he's brought his A-game to this. His hand's shaking with the gun. You remember me or do you know who I am? He's getting attacked, punched, overpowered. Then by the end of that trailer, it looks as though he's confronting the same yeah. guy again and dealing with him. 
pretty handily. Yeah. So that's growth, even in a trailer. The concept, Stephen, I love visually. Like these sort of movies, I love double personas. Yeah. Where you put this sort of mask on, you become a different person. But almost it's like the real person's a mixture of the two. Yeah. That's what I love about yeah. Batman so much. And to an extent, Arrow, over Queen. Yeah. <laughs> I love it when you mix these two sort of personalities and you've got this, I don't know, reinvigorated figure that's going out and beating seven shades of shit out of people. That's my kind of film. I love the action. I love John Wick. Big fan of Keanu Reeves and what they've done. This looks as though it's combining all of these with a really interesting story. Thing, the, the logo, it, the, this seems to be the common theme at the moment, the black background. Yeah. Red, 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 yeah. <laughs> the penguin. Yeah, certainly yeah. Matt Reeves likes that as well. But uh, Jordan Peele, yeah. was, uh, I think he's a producer on this, John, because obviously Dave it's always Cadell a bonus, yeah. is obviously the director for this one. He's first director position, I think. And Brown Pictures. Um, Brown, yeah, yeah. I want to see who it is that is involved in Brown Pictures. <clears throat> I don't know. You know that? But I know the company. That's for sure. Yeah. Is it LeBron? You know the you know the um the logo. Yeah. But well, yeah. I'm talking shit. It's not LeBron. No chance. But I know I know the logo anyway, that's for sure. Uh, and obviously, yeah, behind you. Yeah, Leonard Brown from a hard day's night. <laughs> uh, help. Uh, yeah. I think about LeBron yeah. James for some reason. I don't know why. Um I think he owns a company. But it's certainly not Bron. Yeah, uh, he's not that good. No, he's not that fucking good. He's amazing at basketball, <laughs> but he's not, he's not a film producer, not yeah. yet. But uh, Stephen, really, really interesting. I do remember the first trailer. Now, yeah. um, I had a little rehash. It looked brutal. The story looked great. And Dev Patel looks as though he's possessed, both as a director, the performances he's getting out of the cast, yeah. and within himself, acting too. Doing double duty is always incredibly difficult. Is, I yeah. wouldn't know, I've not done it, but from what I've heard. I can imagine, yeah. <laughs> It's very hard. He looks yeah, as though he's do done. Your bit, then stop. Go behind the camera. Watch yep. what you've just done. <laughs> if you're Taika Waititi yeah. and Jojo Rabbit, and you're yeah. basically kicking about playing this mental, f- sort of fictitious five-year-old version of Adolf Hitler, and you can do like star jumps and whatnot, skipping, and skipping, yeah. and like curse and swear, then I'm sure it's great fun. <laughs> but when you're doing like a hard-hitting drama action kind of film like this, where it's taking it's a lot out of you, a lot of young directors young actors are doing at the moment we've yep. seen it with michael b jordan as well yeah. and i think um you've either got it or you don't have it you know and i think if they've got a vision and they've got something in their head that they want to put to film sometimes it is best to do double duty um if you're wanting it clint eastwood's been doing it for such a long time yeah. and he's he doing it right up to crime macho i think so so much so that i think they had to change a ruling didn't they, they for, did, yeah. yeah it was um, um i can't remember the western it was yeah. a western where the director stepped away, he filled in, yeah. and they changed it afterwards. I can't remember the ruling, but you can't do it now. That's it, yeah. And obviously we've seen that with um, Bohemian Rhapsody. I think one of the direct the directors stepped away. Yeah. And the other guy stepped in, didn't get the credit. That's right, yeah. Indirectly. Oh, Brian Singer. Brian Singer yeah. stepped away, yeah. and I think someone else stepped in. It was uh, Dexter Fletcher. Dexter Fletcher. Yeah. Didn't get the credit. Yeah. So um, it was that ruling. You can't have them step in mid-production. That was Clint Eastwood that started that. But Stephen, you're right, it's great for Dev Patel too. Because he's now sort of branching out. We've seen it with Margot Robbie, Michael B. Jordan, as you mentioned. It gives you longevity. Yeah. If you're maybe falling by the wayside as an actor, if you have proven yourself to be a producer, a director, a writer, you're going to have great longevity. He's a fantastic actor. And it looks as though he's going to be a fantastic director as well. So hats off to the guy. Yeah. Um, it does look a very good film one I'll enjoy so I'll be keeping an eye out perhaps going and watch that in the theatre that looks like an IMAX kind of film oh, yeah, yeah. I was thinking that when I was watching it yeah. the audio thumping and just the rumbling so oh, I've seen Tenet I've seen John David Washington doing the same thing in the kitchen Yeah, not an IMAX a big theatre a restaurant kitchen isn't yep. it yeah. and it just works yeah. all the, the utensils kitchen. and yeah. microwaves to fucking mangle people's skulls with yeah. so. cleavers <laughs> yeah it just works <laughs> Really does. But what's your thoughts? What's your thoughts on Monkey Man? Official trailer too. What's your thoughts on Dave Patel? What you've seen within the trailer on the concept on our reaction? Anything you want to share, put it down below in the comment section within reason. Like the video if you've enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel, hit the bell icon to get notifications for future reactions like this. So if to be said, until next time, thank you very much for watching. Don't know why I'm whispering. Bye bye.